Amen. It's the ISO God Sensei, the greatest. 2k in existence and look man speed boosting has been confirmed for nba 2k 24 make sure y'all put hashtag speed boosting nation down in the comments realistic ball boy take two is basically confirmed to increase micro transactions even more so nba 2k 24 will most likely be the most expensive 2k in existence apparently there's a about to be a bunch more 2k tournaments all over all in general we gonna get into all that but before we get into that y'all make sure y'all subscribe if you are new help me hit 275k.5 we're like 100 subscribers away make sure you hit that damn like button it helps young swan grow now look we done made it house of highlights posted my tweet you know, I made a tweet a couple days ago saying, see, told you people can speed boost IRL. Keep it in NBA 2K24. And then I added Baluba, right? And you know, it, it got a little traction. House of Highlights. Hey, man, I told you I'm tapped in. I'm connected. I'm the chosen one. The voice of the community. You feel me? Now, look. Ronnie comments, we always are ahead of the curve, okay? Y'all let me know if y'all think this is a carry or not. But look, this is basically a confirmation, my boy. He's, he's saying, what, why why would he comment on this if speed boosted? <laughs> if speed boosted, would it be in 2K24, right? He would ignore it like, oh, this is embarrassing to the game. This not, you know? He the community manager of the hoe. He the face of this hoe, right? He the president of this hoe, but really got no control, right? He's saying he proud of this. You feel me, right? So 2K, better give me that explosion, my boy. That realistic movement. It's a lot of explosiveness in basketball that they're trying to take away because they're bots. <laughs> Hey, Speed Boost Nation, down in the comments, man. Speed Boost Gang, that realistic symbol. Now, this Herb guy tweets out that basically NBA stars are going to be hosting exhibition tournaments for $10,000 prize. You know, I don't know anything about this, but he also tweeted, NBA 2K has signed a multi-year deal with 1UP, a competitive gaming platform to become a official on-demand esports platform for basketball and the game franchise. Now, this is an L. Ever since the league came into the game, what was that, 2K18? The game just turned horrible, right? Like, everyone knows that, bro. Like, just turned horrible. You could try to say it's more realistic, but 18 was one of the most broken, unrealistic 2Ks ever, but they tried to make it realistic. That's the problem. Every time they try to make it realistic, it becomes the most unrealistic and it makes like no sense it's just a broken game but anywho he's saying 2k and one up will launch a new tournament system that gives every day nba 2k game players an open pathway to monetize their gaming skill the deal begins with nba 2k 24 which releases on september 8th hmm, interesting y'all excited about this i hope people don't cheat on this hoe one up will create a series of free online tournaments hosted by nba stars fans and competitive players alike can join more details to be announced in fall now i guess i guess homie got connects uh apparently people are thinking the 250k tournament is probably gonna leave um and 2k is not responding so who knows man hopefully this does help the community in some way but it just seems like when they try to make the game more realistic it becomes more unrealistic and just more unresponsive and just delayed bro you feel me them old 2ks that people be saying are arcade a lot of people actually view them as realistic even the sim guy you know they're they're not brainwashed online and all that but it's like they were way more smooth and people use real moves now they done nerfed all the realistic moves right because of the crybabies the little envious sim old heads they done nerfed all the moves and now people are going to do what's unpatchable which is the left right why would they do real move moves if they're ineffective you know they're just gonna left right bro Th this is what people don't realize and then if they can't do either they're gonna do something real disgusting like people gotta <laughs> take two apparently double their pay so what this means I i'm also hearing that 2k23 sold like the most uh micro transaction ever and i'm also hearing that it's gonna be the most sold 2k besides 2k20 and y'all know why that was the most sold 2k it wasn't because the game was the best but um yeah 
I, I think I think uh the 2K23 numbers is all a uh, fallacy. It's a delusion. It's fake. I played the game. It was very dead, especially in matchmaking. Everyone I know quit. It's hard to find teammates. Uh, I keep running into AIs in the wreck. I'm running versus the same people in matchmaking on next gen and current. I think with the two games, there's some type of number inflation that they're doing. You feel me? Like there, there's some way, like maybe people like when they buy two games and stuff, it like, it counts as two, you know, like, and a lot of people with the prices, you know, it's like a, it's an illusion. It's not like cold, hard numbers. So you can't really stack them against the other two Ks. And you know, basketball is a growing sport, first of all. So, I mean, the 2K community didn't blow up till 17, to be honest. And um, yeah, bro. So I think they're definitely finessing with this two, two K thing. I think if the 2-2K thing didn't exist like it does and how it's marketed, it, it would have significantly lower numbers than, you know, like 17 and 19, man. See, look, if you weren't aware that Zex in charge of the publisher of NBA 2K, GTA Online, and more are specifically incentivized to increase microtransactions. They have pay goals tied to it. Goals that are increasingly central to their pay from last year. Okay, this is what I be telling y'all. This is why I be telling y'all, y'all need to be on these dudes heads that are the logos and the next makers, bro. They are the reason y'all have to keep spending more on 2K, bro. Literally, because the voice your voice can't get loud enough because there's creators fighting versus creators. There's the, you know, the sellout ones, the keep they mouth shut ones, the signed it on the dotted line ones. Then there's the real ones like me, which is very few, right? There's all the ones that want to fly out and get wine and dine. They're not going to spaz about the, the, the price of the game bro let's be real dog 150 dollars a bill you feel me that's crazy it's a tax right off for me i feel bad for y'all i'm an empathetic soul and it's like it's gonna keep getting worse and even when you think past it from a creator's perspective why would a casual person get and play 2k why would a kid why would a grown man with some sense that's not a delusional sheep bot. Why would he get 2K and play this hoe? It's $150 a build and the builder's confusing as hell, especially for a bot. So they gonna mess up on a build and bam, they waste on one build? What? Come on, bro. It's not free to play. None of that. Like, even if it was free to play, it still would have. It don't matter. I'm, I'm telling you, this hurts creators, but creators don't realize that. This whole hate creators, it hates the casuals, and it's a slippery slope. This is why I be telling y'all, y'all got to go at these these creators or your voice will never get big enough to make change all that uh oh i'm gonna quit let's boycott it. bro you're gonna be replaced it's just like the drug game you cut off one you cut off the leader someone's gonna replace it's always gonna replace because basketball is a growing sport if all youtubers quit they're all gonna be replaced it, literally bro so i mean i'll be i'll be trying to i'll be trying to put y'all on i'll be trying to put y'all on game but y'all y'all be just trying to say i'm some hater i'm not trying to you know y'all y'all gotta understand there there's incentives to not speaking out against 2k you can now get wine and dine free builds talk to nba players all different type of stuff now because like how i was making fun of these dudes for just you know selling their soul for no reason now that now they can you know they get to go up to 2k early come back with footage and get the highest videos a big view boost like come on bro they ain't gonna be hardcore about this hoe. but hey hey here we go again yeah here we go again people talking this but when this hit the fan everything i'm that made me now break it down yo off the top of the dome dome